Captain eight, Generic. Seven, six, five, four. And three, what is the robot that two, Captain Generic one, is facing? Fight! Robots fight! Oh, I see. I think that this is Wild Strawberry's other other robots. I believe, if if, uh, if my memory serves correctly. Kyle, I've seen more than a hundred robots this weekend. Yeah. And I don't have a lot of uh, space in my memory for all of them. No, but that one's not working anymore. There we go. Maybe. Maybe. Wow, is Captain Generic going to kill both of Wild Strawberry's robots? Holy smokes! Just pushing it right into that camera. I'm really glad we put the cages on those cameras. I don't think that Bert can do it. No. Oh no. Bert, be gentle, be gentle. I mean, it's a grudge match, Bert. If you you do what you gotta do. Oh! Hey, that's what we like to see. <laughs> wow. All right, and the uh, mystery robot here looks like it is dead. Yeah, that's not Ooh. good. Tap out. That's yeah, a tap out. that's what wow. we thought would happen. All right, Captain Generic wins two matches from what I believe to be the same team, different robots from the same team. All right, so let's... Have they settled their grudge, Kyle? I, I don't think so. <laughs> Is that that team going to bring out Wild Strawberry again? Uh, that, that seems likely. Yeah. They really need that screwdriver. Okay, so we're going to talk about what's going on in the three-pound bracket. So let's see, when we go up to the winner's bracket, we have moved all the way through. We're now going to have Silent X. They are waiting for the winner of the loser's bracket to come play. Silent X, yeah. So down in the loser's bracket, we're gonna have Polywog facing off against Dread Hades. Uh, they're going to fight for the opportunity to face Samurai. Yeah. And then we have Jack Rabbit facing off against Blackbird. They will be going to face the winner of Samurai and whoever they end up competing against. And the winner of that match will then eventually have to go on to face Billy. This loser loser's bracket is a grind. I mean, you just have to go through top-notch bot after top-notch top bot. Now, uh, Kyle, if my math is correct, that means that we have 10 or fewer matches left in the day. That is correct. And we are going to crown two winners, the winner of the Beetle Weights and the winner of the 12-pound full combat. Right. The 12-pound full combat is down to it is its potentially last fight. Now, I do want to talk about uh, what I feel is a, uh, a very healthy developing rivalry between the Billy and the Bobby Camp and Jameson Go, Lucy Dew, and uh, David Jin. Yeah. David, Lucy, and uh, Jameson, they're all friends. All they're friends. They all live in Massachusetts. Pit. They all work together, yeah. Right. They're sharing pit space. And just two tables away are Billy and Bobby. Yes. Yes. From Colorado. Now, Jameson Go has successfully knocked out Billy. And uh, the question really is, can, uh, can Hot Leaf Juice. Can Hot Leaf Juice do something very similar? Will uh, will we see a similar strategy from David Jin and Lucy Du? Yeah, they probably learned a lot from that last match. Let's see if what they're going to implement. They're loading into the box right now. Wow. Speak of the devil. So wow. this 12 Kyle, pound division, I've manifested the fight. You manifested. Yes, indeed. All right. Now, Kyle, you were saying there was packing tape on Bobby. Let's see if it's uh, visible. Zoom in on Bobby, please. Let's see that face. No! Oh, no! Too much packing tape! Look at that! Is that what's holding those arms on? Yeah. Kyle, so. that looks like an Amazon box that got rerouted to Alaska. Wow. <laughs> this is the 12 pound final fight here. If Hot Leaf Juice can win, they are going to take home that golden dumpster. If Billy wins, we're going to see a rematch. Now, yesterday, Hot Leaf Juice and, sorry, Bobby, Hot Leaf Juice and Bobby faced off, and Hot Leaf Juice successfully just killed Bobby's wheels. Yeah, chopped it all the way down to the floor. 
Let's see if David Jin can do it again. Wow. Good mobility from Hot Leaf Juice. Hot Leaf Juice just loves showing off that, that mobility before That is just intimidation, Kyle. Yeah. That's an intimidation move. Hot Leaf Juice is running in the Eight, undercutter configuration. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Fight, robots, fight. For the finals, for the Golden Dumpster. Oh, and Bobby is now pirouetting. Hot Leaf Juice just hanging back, content to uh, sit right outside of the reach of Bobby's weapon and chew away at those big blue foam wheels. Yeah, taking their time. You will picking know their shots. You will know that Hot Leaf Juice is winning if you start to see blue foam getting sprayed all over this big box. Jonathan Clark so close to victory, being denied by by this team. Wow, two minutes left here in this match, 60 seconds down, and Bobby is getting shorter. Oh, no! no! Bobby, no! Bobby's, Bobby's right hand wheel is gone! Move, but on that weapon, that weapon is what's keeping Bobby up right now. That's why they're able to move around, but this is not a great situation for them. They don't have a bunch of control. Bobby has nothing to lose, and you can see David Jin circling like a shark. Yeah, now their weapons are just the right height to make contact as well, so we're gonna see a lot more sparks for the last half of this match. We're at one minute and 29 seconds left. Bobby with uncontained chaos. Now coming for Hot Leaf Juice. David Jin hanging back, trying to knock off that other wheel. Uh, Leaf Juice number one ranking robot in the 12-pound division. And we are seeing why they've taken down Bobby once already in this particular tournament. Let's see if they're able to do it again for the final. This is for the Golden Dumpster. This is for the prize. Wow, weapon on weapon contact there from Hot Leaf Juice and Bobby. And I will say, even though Bobby is down one wheel, surprisingly mobile, Kyle. Yeah, very mobile. Moving around very cleanly around the box, actually. 40 seconds left. The other Can Bobby pull out the impossible? Just that blade gl uh, gliding across the floor at this point. Wow. Whoa. Wow. Whoa. Right. What is happening? What? Bobby says, I'm going to put on a show if this is how I'm going to go out. I love it. I love it. Wow. All right. Bobby is now upside down. Not the place where Bobby wants to be. We're down to the last 13 seconds. 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. That is the end of the fight. Wow. Weapons off. Make your way to the door. Wow. Hot Leaf Juice 100% still functional after that match. The audience loves it. Yeah, Hot Leaf Juice is looking good. And look at oh, Bobby. Bobby. Bobby's face. Bobby, what happened? Bobby is not happy about that outcome. We're going to go to the judges right now and find out who wins. Who wins the 12-pound full combat division? All right, let's start with you, Andrew. Your thoughts. They, oh. are, uh, they are frozen. All Either that or them. they're trolling us. Okay, Andrew, yes. Your thoughts. Yes. Um... The audience won that match because we all had a good time, but I got to go with Hot Leaf Juice on that one. Hot Leaf Juice. He's not a hot bean juice drinker, that guy. All right, we're going to move on over to Don. What are your thoughts? Uh, hot Leaf Juice. All right. All right. Pretty conclusive there, Hot Leaf Juice. Hot Leaf Juice. So, Jack, bring us home, my friend. Yeah, Hot Leaf Juice. Although I'd like to officially give my vote to Billy just to be a bit awkward, but... <laughs> <laughs> All right, so there we have it. We've the got a winner. judge's decision for Hot Leaf Juice. Judge's decision, Hot Leaf Juice. Your winner of the 12-pound full comp...